Yo, what up guys, Jens here, and today I'm gonna do some Roguelock Druid vs RMP. But first I want to do a disclaimer, you can see the win loss, it was fucking terrible. Uh, we haven't uh, played the uh, Roguelock Druid this much since beta. We did 51 games yesterday. Vix, which is my rogue, uh, haven't played um, for a long, long, long fucking time. And uh, we didn't really play that much since TBC came out because of gear, it's fucking dog shit, our gear. Um, even at 2k MMR, which we ended up on, uh, we are probably the worst gear team we faced. Um, especially because, like, if I get outgeared, I'm the best geared out of the tree. And if I get outgeared with full PvP gear, but uh, only blue still. Then my my druid and my my rogue just get completely shot on in terms of gear. Now this is extremely important, especially on the rogue. Uh, obviously, having the druid with some gear now and having 400 almost uh, spell power, it's very important because we have more opportunities to kill. But uh, mostly, not having the rogue with either raid gear or heroic and badge gear, it's really bad. Um, it's not a problem though because he will get gear as the season progresses obviously and as we get higher and higher because me and uh, in uh, Sebo Sebe can uh, actually kind of not really carry because we don't over gear anyone but we can at the moment carry somewhat of the load um, and somewhat hide his gear Still, if he gets caught up in the kidney shot, it's 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 very fucking scary. Or if a warrior intercepts him, it's very scary. He doesn't really have that much resilience. I think he has like 200 <coughs> and something. That is good enough for rogues if they have raid gear. The problem is that he doesn't have raid gear, so we can't be aggressive. And it's like a snowball. If you're not, if they are not really trying to peel him, but instead they they can just kill him. It's very hard. His weapons are uh, the Alder, Alder rep weapon, which is this one. He has really bad gear, guys. I'm not joking. Uh, it doesn't... Yeah, let me... Uh, it's not collections, it's factions. The Alder, it has this weapon as his best weapon. And uh, it doesn't have Blink Strike. He doesn't have Landros Shifting Swords. And he doesn't even have the, because he shouldn't still, because he doesn't have good legs, so he doesn't have the the leg enchant from leather working. He's missing around 300 to 400 uh, spell, uh, not spell, uh, attack power, considering other rogues. His emo hits for way less than any other rogue. He's gonna get the main hand this week, and uh, after that it should be a bit better. And as we go up and up and raiding, uh, he will get more points like me and Sebe did. And you will have enough for uh, for good gear and hopefully get full gear before the season ends. So next season it's uh, easier. Uh, our goal this season is to reach Gladiator, I think. But not we don't even have a goal. Uh, at the moment I just want to have fun. And uh, hopefully in season 2 we have around the same gear. We will never have the same gear because it doesn't raid, obviously. But I don't think it's much uh, of a problem as long as he has PvP gear. The problem is that at the moment he doesn't have uh, either PV or PvP gear. He could have legit like 40 resilience and uh, we would be higher if he only had raid gear. Because his pressure would be so insane that it, the enemy team wouldn't really have time to just focus on going super ham on him. Because Roguelock Druid is all about momentum, and TBC Arena, it's all about momentum. And the moment someone lives at 1%, which happens all the time with us, the moment someone lives at 1% and they recover, they have uh, our momentum was just lost as Roguelock Druid. And uh, now we need to play defensive, and, um, and it's really hard. But, but yeah, let's watch two clips of RMP. I'm gonna let the uh, the comms go first and then um, I will uh, go back and uh, analyze the game itself. But uh, yeah, let's uh, listen to what we say in game. Yeah. Let's 
it's only two large prismatic shards. It's human. Yeah, yeah, actually. I'm gonna come stun on you, maybe, if no. possible. I'm sending the pet though, so... I'm gonna go with the pet, okay, but okay, yeah, I'm yeah. sucked. Yeah, I have full hopes right I'm now. Close, I'm close to the tomb though. Okay, I cloak okay. here? Okay, I blind rogue, I blind rogue, yeah, fuck yeah, it, fuck yeah. it. Nice, 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 I love that line. I'm gonna fear out, okay? Or you sap, okay. can you sap? Yeah, I can. Yes, okay, 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 you. I got you. Thank it. I sat this trinket, sat this trinket, sat this trinket! I can't catch you, I can't catch you yet. Yeah, I, I stun Rogue now, I stun Rogue now, he has no yeah, trinket. Yeah, full fear, full fear, full fear. You need to kidney. Yeah, kick Polly, kick Polly. Stacking wounds, stacking wounds. I'm gonna call off, I'm, go I'm gonna call off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Into another fear. And into another fear. I, I full rupture, he can't, he can't, he can't re. Okay, 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 okay. He can't re, he can't, he can't. He's out. Oh, I trink it, I trink it. I kill him now, I kill him now, maybe. I bash I got him out again. Nice, 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 nice. Evasion. Okay, clone priest, clone priest, clone priest. Mm -hmm. I mean rogue. Fuck. Yeah, nice, yeah, yeah, perfect, yeah, it perfect. It was really good. Really, did really he PS on top of it? I'm gonna fear uh, yeah, the mage. He PS in the clone. I kicked him, I kicked stacking him. Stacking wounds, stacking wounds. Yeah, he's dead. He's dead, dead. Yeah, yeah, locked. One sec. Getting it, and he's dead. Kidney, kidney? Yeah, he's dead, he's dead. Rupture again? I think so. Okay, <laughs> nice. <laughs> Okay, now let's analyze the game. I'm gonna mute the converse and let's see. There's quite a few moments in this game. This team was around 1.8 MMR. Like, you're not gonna see the best RPs in the world right now. Um, but as we go up, you will have a better understanding of the matchup and what makes the, the matchup actually really fun to play in TVC. Now, we are facing a hum uh, alliance uh, RMP, so we know two things. The rogue is uh, the rogue is human, and the priest being dwarf, it's probably one of uh, the hardest targets to kill, because his stone forms the poisons. Now, here, they open super hard on me. I don't know why they open on me. They should have opened on, uh, on Vix, because he's an... Um, in a sap, so you just open super hard on Vix and uh, you see as the warlock, and you should be able to kill true heals uh, with the priest dispelling. Luckily, they didn't know that, so they go on me, which is uh, in season one, it's not that bad of a play, like it's it's not terrible because uh, because I don't yet have the gear to survive uh, an RMP and even in later seasons surviving an RMP it's extremely hard. Now they go on me, we blind the rogue. The idea here is if you want to go super hard you need to commit at least a trinket and if you trinket we are gonna go on you. Now the rogue doesn't trinket though and they keep doing damage to me, they CS, the, they blanket info and I don't really have hot so I remove with devour, which I do, and now the priest wants to fear, and I slow them, but he still gets the fear, and I can't dispel him, and the fear path actually takes behind the tomb, <coughs> and I can't really send my pet there, uh, my pet is on the mage regardless, and the fear was kind of bad, because they have no pressure, the rogue trinket the, the sap into another sap, obviously, and now I'm gonna get the... Um, the fear on the priest. Like you can see, like if it's a Gundar MP, I think the mage would just be here spamming arcane explosion. But as you can see, the double sap was really good because now I get the fear on the priest in a sec. Yeah, and uh, I pop everything and we go super hard on the rogue. I kick the ship because I don't have this spell yet. And since I don't really have this spell, I don't want him to ship me or the or Vix, <clears throat> so I just kick uh, ship. But usually you want to kick Frostbolt. I get the emulate, and I go for another fear. I get the fear, and I I, I re fear because I thought he would do trink at the second fear, but he didn't. And now the rogue um, has rupture, cloaked. And he vanishes. So I'm gonna use this time to have uh, to do something here, which is uh, mostly banish the pet. I'm fearing the mage because no DR. The priest is in a clone. I banish the pet, even though the rogue is out. He still has uh, rupture, and he still has cloak up. So I banish the pet. Rupture breaks the stealth, and Vix goes really hard on him. Again, 
the priest trinket the clone into a bash <clears throat> and here it's just gear um, here if uh, if Vix has uh, good gears the rogue might even die in the after really fast after the ship shot now we clone the rogue after that, uh, Ingvo said, uh, or Sebe said, that he shouldn't have cloned the rogue, but I, I still think it was actually a really good clone, because everyone is on DR, uh, or the priest is, is on every DR, and this clone allows me to... only allows the priest to heal for 2 seconds, because Fury is coming off DR in 7, the rogue is in 5 second uh, cyclone, and the pain sucked into it as well, so... I dispel the polymorph, he roots the Vix, I fear the, the mage here. And here I'm already running to towards the priest. ECS is my fire. He used the belt, obviously didn't backfire. If it backfired he would actually just die. And here I don't have devour. I could have spell stoned actually. I think I do by the end, yeah. Because I'm like, oh, this removes <laughs> the CS, so I just fear the, um, the priest. The belt is still up, it's so strong. And also a power the shield on top of it. It's just so strong. And since I'm still lock on fire, just train life and we kill him. Like I said, this RMP is not the best, uh, and you're not going to see like the best players ever. But I just want you to, to have uh, a notion of uh, what we do against RMP. And uh, we face a lot of RMPs. We usually win them. Most of our losses are against comps, really fucking scuffed comps like uh, Enhance, uh, Warrior, Resta Druid. It's like, what? And uh, those are the games that actually gear matters uh, a lot more because Druids live on 1%. But uh, let's listen to this one. Another Iron Pin, Blade's Edge, another... Is it even the same? Uh, I... No. Is it the same? Probably it is, I don't know. But um, let's watch. Oh, and in this game you're gonna see why Stone Form is so strong. No? Wednesday. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna get the shield, this is all. Okay. No, it's human. It's human. Yeah, I'm just yeah. gonna get in combat. I'm, I, just I get go. in combat. I'm a tree. I'm salting myself up in tree. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna be in combat now. We do the 2v2. I'm drinking. Mm -hmm. I need to slow down this priest. Got it. No. I got the rogue. Nice, 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 nice. nice. Open priest. Open we open priest. him. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. Priest, priest, priest. I'm gonna fear the, the rogue. Yeah, I'm rooting him too so I can maybe okay, kill him. Okay, okay. I see the mage just I'll to cover. Garrot, Garrot. He resisted it. I'm gonna course. call him. I bear it. Oh, he vanished. I can't. I did, Kick I ship. Yeah, into a fury on the mage. Uh, he's stone form. Killing the rope. Rope, rope. Okay, I'm CS'd. They blinded me, they, they're gonna kill me after this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you yeah. don't keep the rogue on mage. Yeah, I'm trying to keep the rogue. Okay. I kept him, I kept him. There nice. nice, nice. I'm gonna fear the priest. Do, okay? you wanna, what do you wanna do? Go rogue? I, or yeah, yeah, priest? yeah. Rogue, rogue, rogue. Rogue, no trinkets. Yeah. I, I kick sheep. I can fully fear sure. the priest here. Double fear. Oh, he got me out. This is fucked. No, 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 no. It's still fine. Yeah, Fearing the mage. I can flash you, okay. Fearing the mage. Uh, I'm kidding. He's yeah, bashed. yeah, the mage is fucking feared. I can blind the healer. Yeah, do it, do it, do it, do it. I did. Evasion, I evasion as well. Yeah, I can't stop anything from the mage. I can stack wounds. Okay. I can stop mage. Try. Yes. Okay, okay, you, you, you do it. Fearing the yeah. priest. It's super I gear. Priest, I'm CS. I guess. Oh, mage, mage, mage. Okay. Kick priest, kick priest. We I'm feared. Okay. Will this? I'm stuck. Jump priest, DR. Uh. Nice, nice, nice. Into a fear, into a fear. You're dead, you're dead, I'm home. Oh. Ah, I have stone. You resisted? Cloak. Kill him. I got I mean, it. I yeah. Nice. What the fuck is this game from me? Like, what? Like, my healing is so much better now, it's unreal. Okay, so let's watch uh, the game. Uh, like you can see, the mage has the shoulders. You can see it from the portrait. Um, when I say we are probably this. This rogue must outgear Vix by quite a bit. And uh, let's uh, watch the, the game. I'm salting myself up in tree. Mm -hmm. Let's just. I 
Okay, so I just get in combat. I don't want to get sapped because if I get sapped and they find Vix, it's pretty much over. And I want to slow the priest or the and the mage, so they need to dismount. I'm trying on the mage. I can't. I just slow the priest. Now we get a sap. Usually we go on the target that we sapped. I can go in, push him, spell out the mage, so to cover my fear on the priest. But here, and you're gonna see why I keep saying that RMPs are bad. Uh, here, the priest actually pushes in. The moment I see the priest pushing in to kind of heal the guy, it's the moment I say I pop everything and I say to Vix, just go on the fucking priest. We CC the rogue. And if he uses Trinket on the CC, uh, we can go on him. And if he doesn't, the priest pretty much dies. And you're going to see that's actually the case. Now we get full dots. We open super hard. Now here, I want to fear the, um, the rogue without having to fake the CS. So I CS the mage at the same time my fear is about to, to go off. Usually they resist, which is very unfortunate because of shadow protection. And uh, I get the fear on the rogue. Now the priest is getting under pressure and uh, he can't really get the rogue off. Um, he needs to be kind of lucky, it's a 50% chance he can get uh, the fairy fire and the uh, roots instead of the um, instead of fear. Or he can instantly get fear. Now, the, tr the priest shrink at the kidney and he gets coiled. In this moment, if we have full gear, the priest is kind of dead. The rogue trinkets to help. So we know one thing, and he cloaked, because he had fairy fire. So we know one thing, uh, that uh, none of them have Trinket besides the Mage, but the Mage Trinket doesn't really matter. Now, Sebe does a really good uh, kick here, they wanted to, to ship me, and here, he engineers belt, there you go, the priest actually used engineering belt, so he would have died there, even with the pills on the... Um, on the on Vix, it would have died after, but also uh, stone form, and that's how he tops himself because of stone form. I get CS on Shadow because I wanted to fear the rogue. They go on him. Now here we get a clone, and uh, my pet it's uh, on the priest, which he shouldn't. He should always be on the mage. And here I have a decision to make. Now, I can call my pet uh, back and get the devour, which I, I start to do. But then uh, Vix is saying that uh, we need to keep rogue, so I just uh, go on him with devour so he doesn't get a re because he's blinded. They will go on him off the blind. So we just keep him. But uh, here I should have just dispelled myself and let uh, Sebe just take care of the rogue. And now Vix is asking who, what do you want to do, because no one has Trinket, so we can actually pretty much do whatever we want. And no one is on Fear of the R. So I fear the mage and I say, go rogue, go rogue, no Trinket, Tr rogue, no Trinket. Here, the rogue vanished, and this was the worst fear I've ever did in TVC, I think, because the rogue is in a vanish, I get a fear ward, but I shouldn't have casted a second... Um, fear and I get a full fear here the rogue all he needs to do is just not uh, not open just wait for the fear I try to hellfire the rogue the rogue opens for some reason and Vix is saying that he's dead but I know he's not dead because I have um, I still can fear the mage once and I can even fear the rogue if I want so I fear the mage here I think the mage is saving CS for the for the druid so I fear the mage here, 2 seconds, just so he doesn't completely annihilate Vix. <clears throat> Get some dots on the rogue. And now I'm gonna go kinda ham, we blind the, ro the, the priest full. And I'm just spamming Searing Pain, because if I don't get interrupted on the Searing Pain we actually win. I get a Shadow Bolt proc, they get the paints up. He CSs me on Shadow. 
So now uh, Seve can actually CC whoever he wants. I think he CCs the mage. Or does he? Yeah, he CCs the mage. We get a kick on the on the priest. On Shadow, I think. I devour the polymorph, but I'm still kicked. And the globals are so long. You can see that uh, even though I'm devouring my CC, the globals are super long. I used will, and I still can't cast. I'm like spamming fucking searing pen, and I can't. Tried to get a dot through cloak because he didn't add rupture, and uh, Vix was on uh, on stun. He cloaked and uh, didn't add rupture, so I wanted to get a dot. But he also doesn't have vanish, so it's no problem. We get a clone on the priest, and here I fear the priest, even though the rogue is super sand. The, the priest can't really heal, but uh, I want to be sure that if they actually kill Vix here, we can kill the, the rogue. So I actually fear instead of uh, trying to finish him off, he gets a kidney. The priest resists one of the fears, and now I try to fear him again, and the rogue is already dead. And uh, we win. <clears throat> like, I know I should have, uh, and uh, after these games, I think I started to curse of tongues the the pet. Um, and yeah, just started to curse of tongues the pet and banish him. I wasn't really banishing him or tongues him because if you take a kill and banish, you can't really fear. But yeah, guys, that's about it in terms of strat. Um, I will show you better RMPs in the future. We just need to get a bit more MMR. 2k MMR is still very low in terms of skill, but it, it's really rough in terms of gear. Then it seems that everyone has the engineering belt, which makes that lack of gear even worse because it's like you can kill them if they didn't have the engineering be belt, but then they use the engineering belt and they just uh, completely. So they are completely fine because they never get uh, the backlash of the engineering belt and they just live on 1% and they are fine. And um, for example, in two RMPs, both of them had the engineering belt and uh, both the priest and uh, the rogue on the game before survived. Um, survived with it well the rogue didn't really survive it died but uh, the cc was really also very long but yeah guys i'm gonna start uh, making more clips of uh, roguelock druid um i will uh, update um, i will uh, update the the clips against rmp i'm gonna say the mmr in uh, the title every single time so you know what's better and then uh, if i get a good clips we faced the mirror and um, someone else i think it was Raikou or something on alt like a few weeks ago and we actually did pretty well considering the gear we had um on his alliance rogue by the way and um yeah i think we can actually be one of the best rlds in um, in the region even though we haven't played uh, this much since beta i think the moment vix gets fully geared and the uh, or at least uh, around the same gear as other rogues. He actually said something pretty smart, which is these rogues are already capped in terms of gear pretty much, right? They are all already almost fully PvP geared and they have the best uh, raid gear available. So if you're already facing them at their best and they are not facing us at our best, we, only, we can only improve. And even though we are at the disadvantage because no raid gear, at some point that disadvantage won't be like 20 to 30 to 40 percent. It will be around like what 5 to 10 percent, which is fine. As long as we we have a chance to to win against PV geared rogues, because we also kill rogues, so having less resilience against us, it's not really an advantage. Or ha or being more aggressive against us, it's not really an advantage. Obviously, it's an advantage, but not as big as people think. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed the, the clips. I hope you enjoyed the analysis. I hope you enjoyed the cons. I hope you, you see how we communicate. And yesterday, we need to keep in mind, like, it was late night. Vix had, uh, like, a one-hour tr uh, travel. And uh, he was pretty fucking tired. And uh, we did a lot of games. We started with a pretty good win-loss, but for some reason it seems like the rating and the MMR is super scuffed. 
but uh, but yeah, it, it went uh, pretty well, I would say, for the first queue in uh, in months f with more than uh, 20 games. But yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, today we are gonna play more and hopefully I get more clips uh, to, to show you some games. Uh, I will show the best games against WLD if we face, because WLD it's actually the hardest comp we face at the moment. But yeah guys, hope you enjoyed it. Peace!